SR, BG, and Easy Magic, man. This is supposed to be easy. When the most high make it, it's easy. Like picking the plum, man. Like picking fruit. Like going to sleep or laughing. Or the sunset or the sunrise is easy. It's easy to enjoy the things that are most high. And magic, magic's is supposed to be easy. But we make it complicated. And I'm going to explain that. But first, for the person that emails me and asks me, am I in a wheelchair? And do I got small calves? My calves are humongous. I'm proportioned all the way up and down, man. My calves are so big, you can see them from the front, man. When I'm on a bike, it look like that, man. When I'm rolling next to you, man, you see that, man. You see deep, deep cuts in my calves. So hell no, I ain't in a damn wheelchair. And no offense to people in wheelchairs, but my brother, my calves are humongous. That's my new word for my calves. Humongalai. Now back to the magic. Because the magic should be easy, man. But we make it hard. This same person that was talking about my calves that are humongalai. I can't even work them out no more, man. Now they will not be proportioned with the rest of my body. But this same person, they asked me. I mean, they told me. I'm saying all of this complicated stuff, all of these tactics, and it seems like I'm about to give some some big fancy solution and I, it always revolve around transmuting their energy, praying, fasting, ignoring, separating, semen retention, body gangs. These things are like too easy. This person... Want me to burn candles, juggle crystals, stay up on the full moon, take a shit in the alley. You hear what I'm saying? But the real magic, the God magic is easy, man. Like picking a plum or a tangerine, man. It's easy, man. So this person right here, they want this complicated money spell. They want to go get some okra, chop up the okra, get some eye of nude, pray over here, drink some semen over there, man, so that they can get some money. And when I tell them that it is magical to pay your tithes, they be like, oh, no, that's too easy, man. They want it hard. They want it complicated. But the magic of the most high is easy. You hear what I'm saying? Breaking generational curses. Man, they want to get dream catchers. They want to go all overseas to people to read their fortune and all of that. When all you have to do is fast and pray. And that is magical, man. Now, I'm not trying to get on the people who deal with the crystals and the candles and all that type of stuff. But my question is, how do you burn candles if you wind up in jail? You hear what I'm saying? How do you get the crystals in the place where crystals are not allowed? We never know where we will find ourselves. In the lion's den, there was no crystals or no candles or no broken bones or no goat blood or nothing. It was just praying and being righteous. Praying and being righteous is more magic than any magic. Tell me I'm a lie. Because the Most High, he blesses you when you fast, man. When you practice SR and BG, you get to the front of the line, the front of the line of jobs, man. You get to women way quicker. Is that not magic, man? Is that not like some easy magic, man? All you got to do is just eat the right food, do an hour of workout three times a week, man. Have confidence. 
This is magic, man. This is the easy magic. This is the natural magic. So where did this other magic come from? This other magic is for the NPCs because they're not connected. They can't do it like we do it naturally. They can't do it like we do it naturally, man. Let's take two comedians. Both of them are stand-up comedians, right? And you didn't see this before. One guy is at the Laugh Factory. He went to comedy school. He learned about punchlines and all of that. And when he's on stage, okay, he, he's funny. He's funny while he's on stage. He was taught how to be funny. Then there's this other guy like Martin Lawrence, and he's a comp comedian, and when he's on stage, he's funny too. He didn't go to school. He was funny when he was five years old, man. He was funny when he was three years old, when he was 22 years old. When he's off stage, he's funny. When he's ordering pizza, he's funny. He's just a, a natural comedian, man, versus this other dude. When he's off stage at the Laugh Factory, He's just the regular dude. You hear what I'm saying? One of them is natural and one of them is not natural. We are like the Martin Lawrence. We are natural. We don't need the rocks and all of that stuff. The crystals and stuff. The crystals and the, the rocks and stuff, they look nice and they beautiful and the Most High created them. But me and my guys, we don't need them. Like I said, there was none of them in the lion's den. You hear what I'm saying? It was just faith and praying, fasting and being righteous. That, that's, that's the magic, man. So this other magic, it is for the NPCs because they're not connected. They're not connected to the source. So they need other things to connect them. Let's take two bodybuilders. One bodybuilder is a natural bodybuilder, and he got the genetics to just eat, work out, sleep like the guys back in the 70s. A lot of guys back in the 70s and the 80s, they was like that. Now, you got a guy that don't have them genetics, so he have to take supplements and steroids. Let's take steroids. He have to take steroids, but this guy don't have to take steroids because naturally... He could build that muscle, man. It's, it's the same thing with magic, right? So, so going outside the most high to perform magic, which I did, which I got results, it's like taking steroids. So if I was to take steroids right now, I'm natural, physical steroids and get swole, yeah, it's going to be some results. Yeah, I'm going to get swole faster. Because that's what this unnatural magic do. It just gets you swole faster. It's just beating time faster, right? It's going to be shrinking my natural testosterone production. If I start taking this artificial testosterone, this steroid, it's going to start shrinking my natural testosterone production, which means my testicles are going to get smaller, which means my magical connection to the most high is going to get smaller. Spiritual steroids, man. If a chosen one go out and practice all of this stuff that's unnatural, because everything is in us. The real magic is in us. How did I get off of drugs? It was, it was, it was in me, man. Following the laws, statutes, and commandments of the Most High is magical, man, because you get blessed. You get blessed so much that you say, hey, man, this is the magic, man. It comes with protection. There's protection spells and stuff, and people have to summon up stuff for protection and all of that evil eyes and stuff. I ain't got to buy none of that. You hear what I'm saying? Now, if you do that, that's what you do. I'm not getting on you. I'm not just telling the truth, man. I'm here to tell the truth. Magic, man. What, what was the title of this? Magic. E Magic is supposed to be easy, man. Magic is supposed to be easy. 
When you read all throughout the Bible, it's a magical book, man. It's a magical book. The most we will have to do is hit hit a staff on a stone to get water or something like that or raise our hands or something like that. But we don't have to go collect all of this stuff. We don't have to make these real big altars and stuff like that. Everything is within us. The Most High is so wise that he put everything in us. So there's a guy right now that's up in the county jail that's getting ready to go, go to court. He don't got no crystals. Do they got crystals in the county jail? Man, do they got crystals in the county jail? Hmm. Nah, they don't got no damn candles in the county jail for you to burn and write and declare and decree and all of that. In the county jail, you got you, you got your meditation, your visualization. This is the magic and you push it out and we are out of there. That's how it is. The protection is around us, man. When them bullets was going through my, going, going past my ears and I heard them going. <laughs> man, I didn't know nothing about no candles, no astrology, no necromancy, no nothing. But yet the protection was still there. What's going to happen if you put in a situation where you don't have all of that? Like Rashad Jamal, he don't have the little statue guy no more. You hear what I'm saying? It's supposed to be easy, man. Magic is supposed to be easy. And let me tell you one more thing. I'm going to make a video on this. When you wake up, this, 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 guys, this is something else. I'm going to give you a little preview on the next video, about the next video. When you wake up, everything becomes like a parable. That's what Jesus is talking about. That's why he could speak in parables to certain people and other people wouldn't understand it. You see, when you wake up, you start to speak a whole different language because you start to see that everything is like a lesson. It's, it's, it's wow, man. But magic is supposed to be made easy. And my damn calves are super duper big, man. I believe in working out from head to toe, man. Peace.